to now. It's um, uh, it is something that we've got a lot of uh, people doing it as a hobby, and uh, and being done as time permits. So I think it's uh, it's moved very quickly, and uh, very pleased with everyone's efforts that uh, put into it. It's uh, it's a uh, uh, a really good system. So uh, I really have to commend everybody uh, all the hard work that's gone into it. So. Yeah, okay, uh, back to you then, uh, Tomo, when for TOP, BK, Joyce K and the group. Yeah, okay, uh, again, uh, VK2, HK, VK4 trucks, so and for TOP, uh, portable returning. Yeah, that's 100% uh, uh, correct what you're telling. Uh, it's really fun to have all those people uh, working on this project. Uh, and it's improving every day, so uh, I like it. Uh, and, and like you said, we, it's a hobby. We like experimenting, so uh, and every day, every day we learn some new stuff. Just one question, uh, Adrian and uh, Ian. You also uh, receive in uh, VW mode, in very wide uh, mode, and not on uh, the end mode on the Yezu portable. I have to put it on uh, VW mode to uh, hear you guys. Uh, is that a normal behavior of uh, the system? Back to you, uh, Adrian. VK4 TOX, so in 40 OP. Okay, so well for me, um, I am using, I have my uh, FT2D in Victor Whiskey mode, of course, if I get a Delta November signal, uh, it will show on the screen I hear it okay, it, uh, Ian has transmitted to me in both Delta November and Victor Whiskey on testing, and I hear both the signals, but Victor Whiskey sounds better for sure, it uh, sounds better here for sure, but uh, so uh, I think you're saying that you're having trouble uh, getting the Victor Whiskey or the Delta November, one or the other or something, from what you're saying there. I'll just check that with you, Tom. Uh, you're saying you could not get one of them? Uh, uh, you can only hear on Victor Whiskey or you can only hear on Delta November? I'm not sure. I think you said you, one or the other you could not get. Over. Yeah, I have to put it on uh, Victor W. I have to put it on Victor W to uh, to hear you guys. Uh, I can switch my uh, my handheld to uh, Delta November if, if to check if you guys hear me, uh, Adrian. Uh, maybe in the next uh, turnover. Uh, we'll go ahead now and do it. That's fine. Listen to you and uh, and try it now if you like. We we'll stand by, over. Okay, this is ON4 TOP, ON4 Tango Oscar Papa, testing in Delta November mode uh, for the moment. Do you guys uh, copy me? Yeah, no problem. I'll uh, copy you fine. It sounds um, <clears throat> nearly very hard to tell, but it just sounds a little bit thinner, just slightly, but uh, still very good audio, no problem, over. Yeah, okay. Uh, when you are talking, it uh, switches automatically to uh, Victor W. But when I'm uh, pressing, it's now on Delta November. So uh, I'm guessing uh, you are sending white and I'm sending uh, narrow uh, in C4FM. Okay, I'll just go ahead and do it it shows Delta November when I'm receiving your signal. And I can hear it's a little bit thin. I mean, the audio is a little bit hard on here. I mean, but it's quite readable. No problem to copy. But, uh, yeah, so I got it there okay. And uh, I did this with Ian before as well. Ian sent to me in both modes. And uh, you can see that Delta November when it comes in. The interesting thing is the call size shows on both modes. I think it shows a little bit longer. I noticed some Dick the Whiskey was showed us at the start and it goes away. We're in Delta November, it seems to stay there longer or something, but uh, I'm not sure on that. It's just something I thought I saw there. Anyway, back to Ian. Sorry to leave you out there, Ian, for a couple of rounds. BK2, HK, BK4, CUX, the group. Yeah, no worries, uh, Adrian. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm transmitting in uh, Delta November uh, there, Tom, so, uh, uh, and I have been all the time, so uh, I hadn't changed. Uh, Adrian was in Victor Whiskey and I was in uh, Double November and I suppose that's the one good thing about these, um, the FT2Ds and I think the 1D is the same, um, uh, I do have both of them, the other one, 
another one down the shaft. I think the area uh, must be. Um, it is. Uh, it, it's good for that. Uh, it, it automatically changes to suit. So um, uh, it's not a bad idea. I, I think the ACL have done some nice things with these radios. Um, I just a bit annoyed with all the updates of the firmware, but other than that, <laughs> uh, the radios themselves seem to be quite good, and uh, I think they're, uh, uh, they seem to sound quite nice, uh, and they sound good between the uh, uh, with, between the DMR and the uh, and the C4FM uh, when we've linked them through the uh, Wise X rooms on our uh, dog groups on the uh, 5059, 50591, and 50592. Um, they sound good. So, um, now I, uh, I, I think they sort of match in quite well. Yeah, all right, back to you, Will and Tom. Uh, I'm in 4TRP in the group VK2HK. Yeah, okay, uh, I am uh, VK4 HK, uh, VK2HK. Oh, and 4 TOP uh, returning. Yeah, okay, I'm just, just uh, looking at the call sign. Now I see the call sign on my radio, but not on the display uh, of the next gen of the MMDVM. That's weird. So the, the call sign is, is decoded in uh, the portable, but not on uh, the network, uh, it seems. Otherwise, it would uh, display on the display. I, I get lots of uh, question marks. I guess uh, Adrian has the same problem. But on the radio, I saw your call sign uh, in the last... Uh, the last uh, QSO, uh, the last uh, PTT, so uh, that's working fine. Okay, I'm gonna have to leave you guys. Uh, maybe I uh, I just listen around a bit, uh, the couple uh, next minutes or, uh, or hours. Uh, I also will hook up uh, another repeater here in Belgium, so he can uh, listen to you guys also and see what it uh, does. It's a three three motor repeater also here in Belgium. We have on a big hill. Uh, about uh, 750 meters uh, above uh, the sea level so that's the the only uh, license for Peter for the moment uh, with MMDVM in Belgium so uh, and also the running in 3 motor DMR B star and uh, uh, fusion so thanks for the testing uh, I'm sure will uh, keep uh, the thing going and also try maybe try the Windows version unless the Linux version has a fix uh, this evening or tomorrow or so we see then I will install it on my uh, my VM uh, on the data center, so uh, where I got lots of bandwidth uh, available. Uh, back to you, uh, Adrian. VK four TOX so when four TOP portable. Hi, good Tom. Uh, great to hear from you here because we um, we were just saying uh, hopefully someone else will come in and we'll try to leave a pause. And I went back and had a look at the terminal. I saw that other call. I didn't recognise it. And I thought maybe just someone is listening, logged in and listening and can't talk back. And I never realised it was you. So I said, you know, I saw you call when you called me. So that was fantastic. So thanks very much for coming in because that sort of further proves um, how uh, how viable it all is and how well it works. And uh, a good, very good start anyway, let's say that. You know, it's, uh, it's obviously got a, a way to go, but it's a very, very good start from, uh, from nothing. <laughs> so okay on that. All right, seven three there, uh, Tom. The, the uh, YouTube video now is just about done. It'll be ready in about uh, thirty seconds, actually. I'm just watching it now. It's about ninety five percent processed. It's fully uploaded and processing. So uh, you should be able to watch that YouTube video in about. Uh, actually, right now it's just finished, so uh, it's ready to go now. I'll put a uh, put a post on before with the YouTube video, but it's ready to watch now. It was uploading before, so all good. Okay, seven three there, Tom. Oscar November 4, Tango Oscar Papa, VK4 TUX. I'll put it back to you to say, uh, uh, say 7.3, VK4 TUX. Okay, uh, Adrian, VK4 TUX, uh, 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 thanks for the testing. I'm sure I will watch your video, and uh, as a matter of fact, I also <laughs> shooting a, a video for now, so the whole QSO now. I have about 10 minutes uh, on my cell phone for the moment, so I will, I will need to cut it up a bit. But, um, I will uh, post a link uh, on Twitter also from my video uh, tonight or so, I don't know. It's uh, 4 in the afternoon here, I guess it's uh, a little late in uh, the other side of the world, uh, in Australia. Uh, I don't know how much hours uh, it is difference, I think it's a lot. <laughs> you guys are way behind us. Uh, okay, back to you 73s and maybe uh, we talk to, again, uh, to you again in the future. Bye bye.
Yes, that was very nice. Good to talk to you. Okay, good to